today is day four, Animal Kingdom. But it's not just any ordinary Animal Kingdom day. It's, what is it called? Earth Day. It's also the 25th anniversary of Animal Kingdom. There's only two lanes that we stood in so far. One was for Flight of Passage that took about an hour and a half, guys. I mean, it's worth it. That ride is really good. Uh, we didn't want to buy a lightning lane for it. We rode it so many times. We're like, oh, why, why pay for something that we already rode, right? So, and the second line was for the merchandise. They sold the day of for commemorating 25 years of Animal Kingdom. So we bought that and it was only sold the day of. So we're like, we got to get that at least. So those two lines, now we are actually we just ate too. We ate at um, Tuli Canteen. I love that restaurant. Chicken steak with potato hash and cream. Garlic cream sauce. Garlic cream sauce. It looks different than what we had last time. Yeah. And then cheeseburger bao bun. Hands down, to me, the best fast, quick service uh, restaurant in all the parks. My opinion. Anyway, so we are actually uh, going to walk the Asian Trail and wait for our Landing lane for Expedition Everest. So let's go see what we got, what animals we can find. to Expedition Everest. Expedition Everest accomplished. Now we gotta make our way to the Kilimanjaro Safari. And one thing about that one is we had to keep pushing it back because just other things came up too soon like when we ate, we have to kind of push it back a little. And then the Expedition Everest time came up, but we didn't want it so close because it's so far away we have to walk. We had to uh, rearrange it again and push it back a little bit more. So now finally we get to go on it. So. Time for a breakdown. What do I have in my bag? Just my water bottle, nothing special. I have a little boo boo kit over here, my medication, and just some band aids and stuff like that. Moleskin, and in here, I have a battery bank. You guys need this when you guys come to the parks, okay? Because you got to use your phone a lot for charge um, to do your bookings and stuff. So, uh, you know, that camera battery. And Gatorade, yes, it's a powdered Gatorade. So I, my water bottle, I fill it up at the resort. And then when I come to the parks, you fill it up in the, uh, the bottle fillers, thingy my bobs, and then we make Gatorade. So these are already pre-mixed for this ounce of can, okay? Here you go. Take it off. Yeah. And then in this pocket, I just have my main camera, but in this pocket, I have my main camera, but um, we got some snacks and then we bought some stuff as well. But my main camera and some snacks, that's actually for low light shooting. And then the camera I'm using now is my phone. So that's that. That's all I got in my bag. Nothing special. And then ponchos, if it's a rainy day, I bring ponchos, but that's it. Nothing special. 
nothing you know over i don't want to carry the whole house with me because it does get heavy in time i also forgot to add the straps in okay here so here i got my sunglasses this little case you know why because you go on and off rides so much that you go indoors outdoors you go in shaded areas you go into stores to keep taking up my backpack to put my sunglasses in i was like yeah or even in a pocket i just have this so i just unzip it one hand put it in take it out put it up and i'm done this side i have it for my cell phone so when i'm walking around i can put my cell phone on here and then uh, i can actually film with that too so that's that one ton soup right yeah yeah the one ton soup is not bad i mean the broth is okay one ton is pretty good we also ordered Pot stickers. So many pieces. Five pieces of pot stickers. And we'll see how that tastes. Holy moly, that's a lot of shrimp. My wife got the coconut shrimp. Man, how many pieces is that? I need a cut in half. Oh, okay, so it's butterfly, like, um, oh, it's split, eight. like, oh, okay, so eight, but still eight pieces is not bad. Chicken tikka masala. It smells good, man. It's like kind of curryish, like. I've never had this before. Yeah, this is good. So chicken tikka masala. I think I had it before, like at uh, Boma or the buffet, because it tastes really, really familiar now. Sure. This is a little spicy. My mouth is burning, but not a lot. Very, very tolerable. Tolerable, tolerable, um, but yeah, it tastes good. Good. And then, we also got some sticks. So now we can eat the pot stickers the right way. Because they don't seal them, they, it actually opens up. So. I don't really know how to eat chicken tikka marsala so I just throw the rice in that stuff like Hawaiian style Yakine is pretty good I liked it um it was a little bit weird but you know the coconut shrimp the sauce is like like a barbecue sauce I don't know it's kind of a little weird but I mean the coconut shrimp was crispy crunchy tastes good tikka marsala excellent um the pus stickers not bad and uh one ton soup. We had a half one ton soup. And that was actually pretty refreshing. So overall, I mean, we like the restaurant. We'll definitely go back again and try uh, some other dishes. Like I wanted to try the Kobe burger, but other than that, let's go, go to Navi River and ride uh, that ride. With that guys, we're going to call it a day. Mahalo for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Aloha.